Well, hello everybody. I hope you all are doing well today. Today we have my post review of Carrot Art and this picture is called Charming Witch. I do not remember the name of the artist because it is, I believe it's German. I believe the name of the artist is German. I could be wrong, but it is a foreign name to me and it is something that uh, I'm not very good at pronouncing, but... This is Charming Witch from Carrot Art. Carrot Art is in Germany. Um, this particular picture is licensed. They have a section of licensed artwork and a section of... I'm not sure whether they're licensed or not, but they're slightly like cheaper options. So that is, that is what they have to offer. Um, this is from the artist called oh, oh wait, wait her name is vivian um this is the technical name of the kit when you get it but when you like see the translation to english it comes out as charming witch i call this the charming witch with boobs because the moment some of my uh boyfriend and some of the people in my discord saw it they were like she's got boobs <laughs> yes we are a bunch of immature adults we are a bunch of mature immature adults and the the, the guys just go go crazy for boobs but this is my post review of this particular kit. I had a lot of fun working on this kit. This particular kit, um, quality-wise, is on par with Diamond Art Club. In a heartbeat. Um, my only recommendation to Care Art for the quality of their drills is to possibly switch from having a mixture of 13 and 9 facets to going to full 13 but really i don't know if they need to go to the full 13 because as you can see their stuff is very shiny as it is i, I feel like there can be such a thing as too much shine on a picture and um and and so i, I feel like sometimes the the pictures are too shiny and it's hard to see what they are but i really loved the the quality of these dr these drills they were perfect the glue is perfect. The canvas isn't quite as soft as Diamond Art Club's, but it is still very pliable and able to be worked with easily. It is a fantastic kit. Um, I am actually planning on giving this to one of the ladies that I have become friends with online. But overall, I love the picture. I did have to do some minor adjustments. Um, I had to adjust this crescent moon on her forehead because the way the the rendering was done it just looked like a, a massive blob and I didn't like that so I did change that um I will put a picture here to show you what I what it looked like before and how I changed it to be uh these uh white ABs and I also changed the shapes that it would actually be visible um I did put some blue ABs in her eyes because there weren't any in her eyes and I wanted her eyes to sparkle more. Um, <clears throat> they put white ABs in the mushrooms here, which I thought was cool. They put blue ABs scattered through here. There's white ABs scattered all through the, the white sections. Um, there are red ABs scattered all through her hair. I had so much fun working on this. When I first kitted it up, I, I thought that it was not going to have enough red to do like her whole hair, her whole thing. I kitted it up and I was looking at it and I was going, is this going to be enough color? Is it, Do I have enough drills? I feel like I'm going to be short. But it wound up not being short, which was fantastic. There is a lot of um, confetti through her hair, but I think that just makes it have the depth and the feel that it should have because it like merges the colors and there there's shading and and it looks and flows fantastic. I could not be happier with this picture. Um I did get it in squares. I don't remember if it is in rounds or not. I don't think it is, but it could be. But I got it in squares and it is a fantastic piece to work on. I I have now completed a round and a square for carrot art and I highly recommend them. Um 
even with the conversion from euros, I think it's euros, euros to USD, this still really didn't cost me much more than it did when I'm to, to buy from like a US company. So I would highly recommend their company. Their, their canvas could maybe do with a little bit more fabric feel, not quite so much plastic. But other than that, I really don't have any quality recommendations for, for Care Art. Their, their quality is very top notch. Um, the round drills were fantastic. The squares were fantastic. I had no problems with them. No popping. They fit together really well. Um, I did have trash, of course, like everybody does. But I didn't have an excessive amount of trash. I did actually have leftovers. Uh, let's see. This is how I had my stuff kitted up. And as you can see, there's plenty of plenty of leftover colors for everything. I didn't run out of any colors for anything. Um and uh but yeah, I I think that you if you are looking for a additional company to look at and to to support and to find some some good quality art from Carrot Art is that. Carrot Art has some unique looking pictures. They have some different artists that I don't see anywhere else. They also do carry some of the, uh, Jasmine Beckett Griffith's art. But overall, they're just a really good quality company. And if you're willing to to pay the 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 difference between USD and Euro, which I think is what their currency is, Euro and the shipping from Germany and the wait time, it it would be perfect. Um, I think. For me, it took three weeks for these kits to get here. Uh, that's because they sat in customs for two weeks. <laughs> if they hadn't sat in customs for two weeks, they would have been to me like within a week of ordering. So, but yeah, I hope everybody enjoys this post review. This is just my thoughts and feelings on it. I think it is a gorgeous picture. I think that uh, if you're looking for another company that you want to look into to, to support and possibly find some unique pictures from, I think Carrot Art is that. And uh, I hope you guys show them some some support and uh, try out their, their stuff. Because they have some things that I probably would never do. But this is definitely one that I would. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, since I like to keep my sh stuff so short and sweet, I will see you guys next time. My links are in the description. You're welcome to join me on any of my other channels in the Discord as long as you're over 18. And uh, we will see you next time. Thank you for watching. Have a good day, afternoon, morning, evening, whatever it is, wherever you're at. Bye, y'all.